Hi everybody! Sorry about the hat, I'm having a really bad hair day. <laughs> My hair's starting to grow out and it just doesn't know what angle it wants to grow out at. Um, also I want to apologise for the lighting going in and out. Um, the sun has actually been out today and it seems to be going in and out of the clouds a bit. But every cloud has a silver lining, the sun's actually out. <laughs> so I'm just going to take celebration in that. So today I'm doing something slightly different. Um, Magnus isn't very well, so he wasn't really in the right sort of mood for a day in the life. But I went to Home Bargains earlier, so I thought I would show you what I got because I went in for a couple of things and obviously Home Bargains is not the sort of thing you can go into for a couple of things. So I have three big bags for to show you. I'm just gonna get on because it, it might be a bit long otherwise. <laughs> So first I have a seven pack of tea towels, just kind of cheap and cheerful, red and white, um, they'll do the job. <laughs> These were $3.99, which I thought wasn't too bad for seven of them. Then we have a bottle of Tresemme Cleanse and Replenish Shampoo and Conditioner. This was £1.99 for the bottle. And we have Right Guard Women. This is like a 72 hour protection. It's just, yeah, if they do basic deodorant, really. This was a pound. Some Imperial Leather Orchard and Lang Lang Bath Bubbles. Um, as you might have seen in one of my recent videos, I have the Cherry Bake Well on at the moment. And that's nearly finished because I just spend way too much time in the bath. So I thought this one smelled really nice. Oh, and this one was, this was 99p. Some Carex Strawberry Laces Hand Gel. Uh, this is just obviously where I go out and about. Um, I got a really weird thing with touching bathroom doors. I do not like it because the amount of people I see like, going in and out of bathrooms without washing their hands. So I like to have some of this like everywhere I go. This was 99p as well. Some Febreze air freshener. Uh, this is Fruity Tropics. We usually go for the Febreze. We got the, is it the Airwick one, I think, like a mold wine version. And our health visitor <laughs> walked in the room and told us immediately it smelled like old food. So we have never used that brand since. We just always go for this one. And this is £1.49. Going back to the Carex, I have two of their hand soaps. So I've got the bubble gum and strawberry laces. Uh, one of these is going to be for the bathroom and one for the kitchen. I'm not really sure which one you are. I'm thinking possibly this for the bathroom because it's got a bit of a stronger smell to it, I find. And these were 99p each. Then we have V05 Revive Me Daily Shampoo and Conditioner. And I know what you're probably thinking. I've already shown you shampoo and conditioner. Um, I kind of forgot I'd had the Tresemme. So when I was going like almost to the checkout, I was like, oh my God, I need to go get some shampoo and conditioner. Grab these. And then when I started paying, I was like, oh, I just bought some already, haven't I? So I suppose I won't go need to go shopping for shampoo and conditioner for a while. Um, these were one fifty nine each. And then we have uh, some very thrilling Domestos Zero Lime Scale Bleach for the toilet. Um, Tristan asked me to pick this one up. I'm sure he could probably tell you more about it than I can. <laughs> Is the... Yeah, I suppose it keeps it cleaner maybe? I'm not really sure. Then we have some Thai Orchid Febreze fabric. Great fragrant stuff to make our sofa smell nice. One that's possibly more of an impulse buy, a um, apron, which says, don't go bacon in my heart, I couldn't if I fried. Um, I'm gonna be doing some cookies soon, so I thought it might be nice to have an apron, because I do a lot of bacon, and I ain't bacon. 
this, this is getting to me already, a lot of baking and I'm rather a messy cook. So this might protect my clothes a bit. Oh, this was $3.99. We have some Ylang Ylang and Junapa um, shower gel. Um, this smells really, really nice, even if I'm just butchered the name of it completely. Um, I actually ended up smelling it twice because I put it in my basket, then saw another like bottle of it on another shelf, sniffed it, thought, oh, this smells nice. Oh, wait, I have one. I'm really bad at duplicate shopping, apparently. This was 99p. Just some cotton buds, as we have, well, we completely used all of ours. I tend not to actually use them what they use for. They usually tend to go for really random things, but these were 49p. <laughs> Going back to the baking, I have an oven tray to actually put the cookies on because I've just realised when I got there, we don't actually own an oven tray. We own pretty much everything but. I also have this Garnier Ambre Solaire, however how you say it, kids, um, Santan lotion because as I've already mentioned a couple of times in this the sun's starting to come through and we threw away our um Santan lotion from last year because it was getting a bit iffy so he's got a brand new one for the summer to keep his skin nice and protected from the sun. We have a dustpan and brush because Magnus broke ours <laughs> this is like 89p so if he breaks it again then it's not completely the end of the world. there. Oh, I think we might actually be at the end because the final two things were just truly amazing. I got these babies for $3.99 each. Um, I know what you're probably thinking if you've been watching my videos. I'm on Slimming World. Why am I buying ginormous Easter eggs? Uh, one of them is not for me. One of them is for Tristan because I never managed to get him one. Um, but also just, I'm, I'm a bit unifing about Slimming World at the moment, but that's a whole other video. But if I do decide to carry on, I'm obviously I'm not gonna eat this in one go anyway. I'm not quite that fat. I will divide this up for like sinned poor for the day portions and it'll just keep me going for a while. And even if, like I say, even if I'm not, I'm gonna continue Slimming World, I'm not gonna finish this in a day. So all in all that came to £38.82. So um, yeah, that was that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm not really overly confident on the hauls yet, so sorry if I kind of seemed like I didn't know what to say at points. <laughs> it was probably had a point. Um, I think I am going to be doing a, a day in the life vlog tomorrow. Magda seems a bit more perky this afternoon, so hopefully that will continue on to tomorrow. So I'll see you then. Bye.